All right, welcome back everybody to uh, the YouTube draft tournament. Uh, doing week three, uh, my team, the Blades versus the Delaware Dittos. Uh, this is supposed to be battle of the week. Um, I'm not sure why. I've only had one battle before this, so I think it's just going off of uh, everything that um, Ryan has done so far. Uh, I watched his battles. They're they're really really good. Um, so I think this is going to be at the very least a super difficult battle um, at the very most um, a very very close battle that uh, I, I win um, or lose I think I'm gonna lose this is actually what's gonna happen um, but uh, we'll go ahead and just do our best with the team that we have um, he was really hard to plan for he's got multiple strategies um, just watching his battles it seems like he really knows his stuff uh, team that he has that he can bring is Kartana, Azumarill, Koma-O. Uh, here we go. So, um, Tentacruel, Charizard, and Golurk. Um, we're going to lead Crocodile. Um, I went with weakness policy Crocodile this time uh, in the hopes that I can survive um, a super effective hit uh, instead of the beat up strategy with the flinches. I feel like Crocodile is a little on the nose for my lead, so he might lead with one of his water types um, one thing I've noticed uh, from watching his battles he does a lot of um, like setup he does uh, either you know stealth rocks or um, uh, belly drum stuff like that so uh, I'm leading with with crocodile for taunt um, so even if um, he ends up sent out like a zoomerill um, I'll probably just go with the taunt. I doubt he goes Tentacruel since uh, I am stronger, although he will outspeed me with Tentacruel, so that still could be a good move. Um, so let's see what he leads with here. Um, yep, uh, I kind of anticipated him leading with um, Azumarill, so uh, that's okay. Uh, the Intimidate's going to do nothing because he's most likely a special attacker. If he's not a special attacker, he's going to Belly Drum, which is uh, going to supersede that uh, anyway. Uh, I'm just going to go bring him all the way right up to the top. So um, we will taunt him in the hopes that he tries the Belly Drum, uh, thinking that I might switch out. Yep. Um, and now he can basically change what he's doing uh, or stay in and try to kill me with what he's got. Um, he very well could. He's got double type advantage against me, so um, I guess we'll just see what I can take. Okay, he's switching out. Um, going with Charizard. Very cool. Uh, gonna knock off your item here, Charizard. Uh, that was enough to kill it. How about that? Um, that was a crit, and I will take it. <laughs> Uh, I was very lucky there. Uh, Charizard can be uh, a real problem. Uh, so, uh, he's going with Como. -O. Como is obviously gonna, he's just gonna punch me. Um, that's gonna hurt, <laughs> is basically what that boils down to. Um, I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and switch to. Honestly, I can't think of anything that I, I would want to switch to. Um, I think I'll outspeed him, so I I might just go for the knockoff, get rid of his item, do the best that I can, um, or the earthquake and try to get the, the stronger hit. Um, honestly, he'll probably drain punch me and just get all the HP back though, so maybe the better thing to do is go for the taunt on here as well, um, in case he's also belly drum or... Um, he might, uh, yep, tried to go for Clang or a Soul. Um, we're gonna switch to Arcanine. Um, I've got the Dragon Pulse on there specifically for dealing with Como O. Um, the Intimidate should help. Um, we'll see what he does here. Aura Sphere. Okay, so it's a special attacking one. So. The that doesn't really help with the Intimidate, um, but we can go for the Dragon Pulse, uh, see how much damage we can do with that. Uh, 
what's nice is however much damage I, I deal to him now, he's going to switch to his fairy. No? Okay. Uh, that's okay. So, um, he's going to outspeed me. Uh, which is, is rough. Um, okay, so we got Black Sludge on there. Um, he's probably going to go for a water move. Might go for something else. I'm going to go ahead and just switch in Mantine. I feel like it's the safe bet. Um, he might throw up some toxic spikes or something. I'm not worried about it. Um, yep, that's okay. Um, honestly, if he wants to do toxic spikes uh, again, that's totally fine. Um, I brought a way to get rid of, of that, so um, we'll just do what we can. Uh, get a Tailwind here. He might... I don't think he has a rock move he can use. Yeah, so he'll probably switch out. Um... Okay, he's probably going to go for the Belly Drum. Um, let's see if I can just Air Slash him um, and try to get some flinches, maybe. Do what I can for damage. Um, I'll play rough. Maybe he thought I was going to switch. Um, looks like I can take another play rough. That's good. <laughs> uh, we're going to try to ride out this as much as possible. He maybe thought I was going to switch in um, to try to taunt him again uh, with my Crocodile. So I went for the play rough for the for the kill. And that definitely would have killed based on how much damage he just dealt to my main team here. So interesting. Okay. So going back to Tentacruel, totally okay. Um, whatever I switch in, I got to remember is going to get toxic. So. Um, he's going to outspeed me, but that's okay. Um, so, I think what we need to do, actually, let's... I want to see how many more turns of Tailwind I have left. Just the one. So, we're going to go with Air Slash. He probably outspeeds. Oh, he doesn't. Um, I thought he might still outspeed me. Sludge wave. Okay. Um, not very effective. He'll probably poison me soon. Um, we're gonna go with Tailwind. Try to get that Tailwind back up before he um, takes me out. He probably thinks I have Roost or something. Uh, typically I would, um, just didn't bring it this time. So he wants to get uh, get me poisoned potentially to get rid of the uh, the leftovers and the, the Roost. Um, I didn't bring Dubblade. Would be a great switch in right now. Um, Flinch. Uh, that's a little more HP we get back. Hopefully, uh, between uh, taking him down um, or Mantine dying, it doesn't end up so that I run out of Tailwind right um, <laughs> at the wrong moment when I would be able to, to switch in a Mon for free. Um, so these flinches uh, could actually hurt me <laughs> if I gain too much HP. Um, so I think what we're going to do he keeps you know, gaining more and more HP back as well. So we're going to check again. We've got the one Tailwind. Um, going to go for the Air Slash again. Okay, he's switching out. That's fine. Um, Probably got Thunder Punch, <laughs> uh, which is okay. Uh, my Tailwind petered out. I kind of need to set it up um, to be able to outspeed some of his faster months. Ooh, 
interesting. Um, that is a pretty quick go lurk. Um, let's go ahead and he's going to poltergeist whatever I've got. If the knockoff is stab, it's going to be good against whatever he sends in. Um, it's going to lower his attack with the intimidate. Uh, overall, I feel like this is a good switch in. Um, I've got the poison, that's fine. Um, that was just going to happen one way or the other. We're going to go for the knockoff. You can, that's fine. Switch in your, your water fairy. Uh, oh, going with your Como. Oh, interesting. Um, makes sense. The throat spray. Okay. Um, he probably thinks I'm going to stay in and go for the taunt. Um, maybe it would be a smart thing to do. Uh, instead, we're going to see if we can eat an attack with Eldegoss. Um, if he does go for the the belly drum or the clang of soul, then so be it. Okay, that's good. We can potentially eat another attack. Let's get a rapid spin in, potentially. Um, yeah, we gave him the setup. Um, so be it. At least we got rid of his throat spray, so he didn't get even more power. <laughs> um, we got rid of the toxic spikes. That was the main goal of what I wanted to do. Um, let's see if we can get him to sleep. Oh, the flamethrower is going to hurt a lot. <laughs> uh, that's OK. Um, he's going to be hard to hard to kill at this point. Um, he's going to be very fast. Don't really have anything that's particularly good against him. Um, other than Halucha, he might actually outspeed Halucha now, uh, which is a bit of a pain. Um, we're going to see if we can survive. Probably can't. <laughs> uh, the Intimidate doesn't matter. Going for the... He saw the Dragon Pulse last time, so he might actually switch it up. And... Uh, I mean, he, he's got his boosts, so he may not. Uh, we'll extreme speed, try to deal as much damage as we can, but if he switches out... Oh, he didn't. Um, and that's fine. Um, the Orc Spear is going to hurt. Yeah, that's okay. Um, ending up on the losing side of this battle, it seems. Um, I would like to slow him down. I don't know if Crocodile would outspeed him enough to do so. Um, so instead, we're going to go for Raichu. Let's see if we can, we'll start with the fake out. He might Dynamax anticipating the fake out. Good. Um, that gives us uh, the flinch, which is nice. Now I don't know if if this will be enough or not, but we're gonna see if we can outspeed him. Nope, it's so fast. <laughs> uh, oh, very nice, very nice. I'm excited about that. Um, not enough to kill him, but I did get the paralyze, which was the goal. Um, so I should theoretically outspeed him now. Um, he might switch his go lurk in. Uh, he's got two that are weak to grass. Um, so we'll just go with the grass knot and get the kill. We're good. Now he knows I have grass knot. He might send in go lurk. I'll probably sacrifice Raichu <laughs> since he's got one HP. Um, unless he has something with a prio move. Maybe Aqua Jet. Shadow Sneak? I don't 
know if he gets Shadow Sneak. Um, I guess we'll we'll find out. Dynamic push. How do you go first? Are you choice scarfed? He's got to be choice scarfed. Um, so he's locked in the fighting type move. Um, that's rough, <laughs> to be honest. Um, he's so fast. The dynamic punch. He's going to be what? No guard, so he's always going to hit. Um, my close combat to get rid of my item is not going to do anything. Um, he's playing really well here. Uh, so he's going to outspeed me. He's going to definitely hit me. It's going to automatically kill Crocodile. Um, Halucha at least maybe has a chance of surviving. <laughs> um, if we Dynamax, uh, he might also Dynamax so that he's not choice locked. So um, it is what it is, I guess, at that point. So we'll just try to do what we can. Yep. Oh, and that means he outspeeds me, um, which is rough. probably got Thunder Punch or Ice Punch. Either one is going to hurt a lot. Um, probably the end of the game here. Um, after he one-hit kills my Halucha, he will uh, definitely one-hit kill my Crocodile. So. Uh, but we put up a fight. Uh, it was fun. We've had, uh, we had a, a victory last week. We started with a loss because we took over for a team, so uh, we're one and one. Uh, so I feel like we can still come back from two losses. It's not the end of the world. Oh, looks like I do outspeed him. Um, I will take it. Uh, get as much damage on him as I can. Maybe get another kill if I'm really, really lucky. Um, got the speed up. Max Lightning. That's okay. That hurts a lot. If he goes for Max Lightning again, I don't know. That's tough. It's very tough. Uh, the Max Airstream is not going to be enough to kill him. It's okay. I mean, it's either that or I switch out and you know, hope he goes for electric attack again against my crocodile. Um, but honestly, I don't think that's gonna. I don't think it'd be enough anyway. Um, oh, he would just kill my crocodile the next turn because he's gonna outspeed, and then he would just finish up Halucha. Um, could have it worked better than sticking with Halucha? Possibly. Uh, we may never know. Uh, Crocodile already poisoned, um, so that's rough. Intimidate's nice. Uh, he is straight up gonna kill me. Um, so, oh well. Uh, great game. Um, oh, interesting. He actually pulled out. Uh, maybe he just really wants to uh, kill me with that, with Thumper. Uh, yeah, there's Thumper. <laughs> um, I feel like he could have, you know, just killed me. Maybe uh, he's, maybe he was a little bit worried about it, and you know, he's gonna try to save it. Um, I mean, he knows he can kill me at this point. Um, if this doesn't one hit kill him, then um, then I'm pretty much fucked. Uh, <laughs> But we were already fucked, so... Uh... Oh, how about that? I got a kill. Uh, that's exciting. Um, again, 
I stand no chance. That poison kills me next turn one way or the other. Uh, he'll probably send in his... Oh, interesting. Going for Kartana. Um, maybe just the higher speed, expecting it to uh, to kill. Um, I mean, we're dead from the poison, so it doesn't really matter at this point. But I did, you know, only get 3 owed, uh, so that's nice. Um, I feel like I can come back from that and the, the two losses. Um, I mean, Earthquake is, is straight up uh, just great, but um, we'll go with Knockoff and, I mean, yeah, he's going to outspeed me anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, so, uh, good battle. Um, I appreciate the Golurk switch there at the end. Uh, I feel like you could have just had me, uh, Ryan. So, um, awesome. Uh, as expected, I knew it was going to be a really tough battle, so uh, great job and uh, good luck with the rest of your season. Okay.